Okay. Hello everyone, my name is Zama and this is Ian, the developer of Haven View. Uh, tell us about your game. No worries. Um, it's a Halloween looter shooter. It's set in the 90s, so essentially you're basically starting off with your friends, do some uh, trick-or-treating, and then when you um, discover that there's like an alien invasion, you're uh, basically trying to fight back and save Havenview. So Sounds it's cool. like a race against time. Uh, so what consoles is, is it on? So it's on PC. Um, we've just put it up on Steam, so you can wishlist it. Um, we're probably about a year away still before it's fully released. Um, we're hoping to have a demo up there soon, though. That's always good, yeah. Up to six players, local co-op. Awesome. Um, but yeah, it'll work with like your different controllers. Um, uh, online co-op as well, or...? Um, maybe through the Steam, um, but at the moment only it would only work that way. So there's no full multiplayer yet. Okay. What's your favourite part of development for this game? Um, pretty much like trying to be a jack of all trades, like I've got to learn lots of different things. Um, are, are you also the only developer? Only developer, but I've got an amazing artist called James Merlin in the US. Um, so he does all our art and he's helping with animation and things like that. And what about the hardest part of development? Um, not being able to test multiplayer like solo, so um, yeah. I got to see five people playing for the first time ever before, which was amazing. Um, so that makes, makes it tough though, because you don't really know what's going to happen until everyone sort of jumps on. Uh, so what, is, what has been the general consensus at PAX so far? It's only been like a couple hours, but... It's yeah, it's, uh, it's been fun. Um, yeah, lots of groups through, um, lots of positive feedback, a couple of good ideas, which we'll definitely take on board. Awesome. Uh, and last one, any tips for indie devs out there? Uh, definitely come to PAX. <laughs> like, this is amazing. Yeah. So it's like, even if you've only got like a playable demo or whatever, it's worth like investing in a pod and like just giving it a shot. Yeah, cool. Well, um, that was, that's the end of the de uh, interview. Uh, thanks everyone for watching. The links will be below uh, in the description. So uh, go and check out the game, wishlist on Steam. And yeah, see you all in another one. Awesome. Thanks, Thanks Sam.